Hello, hello. This is going to be a channeled message from your ancestors. There's going to be two piles, pile one or pile two. I'm going to pick a card for each pile for you to choose. Pile one, begin writing now. Create, express, inspire. And pile two, respect your physical body. Detox, rejuvenate, and relax. Pile one, pile two. So pile one, begin writing now. So it doesn't have to be literal writing if that's not your thing, but more creating and expressing some form of yourself. And we're also getting get into nature, coexistence, gather and limit waste. So essentially nurture yourself so that you can express yourself. Nurture yourself so that you can use what you've been through and your healing to shift the narrative of your life, to shift your environment, Four of Pentacles, to shift the way that your plan is creating your path, to, in terms of getting into nature in order to create and express, this is really to allow yourself the express part, right? Because that requires you to kind of be in touch and in tune with your emotions. And that may be kind of the struggle right now. We also have the Empress reversed and the star. So you're in order to switch the Queen of Cups energy, we need to figure out what's causing this Empress to be in reverse. And essentially with the star, what is causing this Empress to be reversed is you not really being in touch with your fullest expression of self. And the only way to really get into that is to start trying. And that's kind of where we got this express card from with the writing and it's like opening the door so that that form of expression can start to really flow out of you again but you have to open the door to get comfortable doing it so you can start to take steps forward we, yeah we have the page of pentacles and four of cups so this may not be something that originally was part of your plan to have to just kind of take a step forward without knowing what to expect but this is kind of saying to take the chance on yourself to be able to kind of step out and say, I know that I have something of value to offer and I'm going to start taking steps to express that because you've been carrying this for some time. And whereas before you were learning from the process of carrying it as well as the carrying it as well as what you were carrying, there's nothing more that you can learn from just carrying it blindly. It's time to start to unpack it. It's time, lovers reverse, it's time to choose yourself. It's time to love yourself. It's time for you to say, this part is not mine to carry and it's time for me to put it down. Nine of cups, because in order to get what you do want, you're gonna have to put it down because there's no sense in carrying 300 extra pounds up the mountain when it's not actually going to come with you to the other side it'd be smarter for you to put it down before you climb up the mountain and traverse up the mountain by yourself because you don't need the things that are going to make it harder for you to some extent there are going to be things that will make it hard for you from time to time but it's about picking your battles picking and choosing your battles nine of wands reversed picking and choosing your battles knowing when to say okay this is something i should put effort into figuring out or correcting or unpacking or healing healing always you put effort into but not when it's someone else's sometimes you help sometimes you don't and you've been taking on a lot of people's healing tasks that aren't yours to take on and that's been blocking you from being able to do this full form of expression so that's what you're really being asked to step into now is to take a step forward and start to express yourself in the way that is in the direction of your goals or desires or dreams and just know that when you take a step forward the other steps will really start to come to you it, it's really about trusting yourself in this moment and in this situation page of swords it's about trusting yourself to express 
it's about trusting yourself to just start the sentence and see where it takes you because you actually have a lot more available that's accessible than you believe that you do and as you start to take steps forward you start to recognize that and see that because queen of wands is reversed you don't see it you don't see yourself socially the way that other people do always you don't see yourself through other people's eyes so you're not getting a complete accurate picture of yourself through their eyes anyway so why not just be fully yourself because if you know that they're not even reading you correctly in the first place then what's stopping you from just fully being yourself if they're going to misread you anyway to some extent right and that's kind of what this is because you have more options than you believe you do and that becomes a lot more <sighs> mm, not easy but you, you have a lot more confidence to walk down the paths that you didn't see previously that you like the paths that kind of light up as you go the paths that light up as you go the higher fence so you don't see all the opportunities that are available to you with the seven of cups and there might be better ones or bigger ones than you could have imagined and with the hierophant what you've been through has prepared you for exactly that and that's kind of the beauty in it so it's almost like you get to finally use all of your experiences to create the opportunity that you've been trying to find because you realize that you don't always just find it sometimes you have to create it and in this situation you're being asked to put in the hard work to do just that just as it said get into nature queen of pentacles she's sitting in nature get into nature and begin writing begin expressing begin to ground yourself and then express yourself sitting on the table right next to me was um king of swords and strength so perfect ending to that because the king would be all about the throat chakra and the self-expression and then we have the strength to actually get yourself get the motor going to get your voice to come out and speak pile two so pile two is respect your physical body detox rejuvenate and relax detox rejuvenate and relax and it shows a little cabin so maybe even some form of getting away or resting answer the call explore travel and live what did i just say maybe even get away if you can so with this we have kind of a clearing out to start fresh um respect your physical body take care of the little things so that the big things can fall into place such as getting proper rest and nutrition and hydration and all of the sleep and all the stuff that you think is not that important if it all starts to fall apart it becomes very important and you start to realize how important your health is when it starts to decline so this is really with the answer the call card i take this two ways i take this to mean you already have been getting hints about the first thing that came to your mind when i talked about respecting your physical body either it's sleep or it's stress or it's diet whatever it was that as soon as i said that you were like oh i know what she's talking about that thing that's the call that you need to answer because that's exactly what is essentially you're being guided to be like okay this needs to be looked at now not that it's an emergency but that you need to take care of the little things so that the big things can fall into place and then answer the call also says explore travel and live so there is kind of a need to stop holding yourself back from having fun or exploring your path in a different or diverse way and also detox is really sticking out to me here the word detox yeah we have knight of pentacles as i said that in reverse so this to me planting seeds would be upright in reverse it's like unplanting seeds so that as i was saying detox is spot on because i also got the king of wands reverse so it's like detox your body and detox your mind and or detoxing your body will help to detox your mind it could be that as well we have the page of swords reverse so this is kind of like 
in terms of answering the call it's like once you do whatever it is that needs to be done in terms of detoxing or at least in terms of getting rid of the pieces that you don't need the extra junk food or the not enough sleep because you're on your phone for four hours or whatever it is taking care of those things is going to prepare you to be ready to answer the call when it comes to what's next or answer the call when it comes to exploration or just living your life instead of just surviving it yeah three of wands reversed it's like you feel kind of isolated you feel kind of like i don't know what i'm looking forward to anymore two of swords and now it's time to pick a path it's time to make a decision that will help you align with what is next for you and with these two cards it's like look internally to explore externally like you need to figure out what's going on inside before you can move forward on the outside and it's almost like you already have the breadcrumbs or you already have at the very least the tools page of pentacles yeah you already have what you need to walk forward on this path because you've given it to yourself already um queen of swords came out in reverse so it, it's not about what you need it's just about how you're expressing it right it's just about how you're putting it into action it's just about how you are maybe even talking to yourself about these things but especially when it comes to respecting your physical body here uh, especially with the, the combo of cards that came out i'm feeling like this is a lot mental um physical body obviously like taking care of the, the basic things like i said but doing kind of like a mental check on yourself. Like, how are you actually really doing? Because when someone asks you how you're doing and you say, I'm good, thanks, how are you? That's not really true. And you need to figure out what about that is not true so you can fix it and stop just ignoring it. That's kind of what will allow you to hear the call so you can answer the call. Yeah, Eight of Pentacles, High Priestess, you know this. You know you've been trying to busybody yourself out of dealing with why you aren't actually fine thanks six of swords the hierophant you've been running from what you know is inside and it's time death and rebirth is here it's time to actually look at why but, but why am i not good why am i not all the way good because just saying i'm good knowing i'm not good when i'm saying it over and over and over but not actually ever addressing the why is not going to help me so that is it's almost like all of all of the why is clouding your head so much that the phone is ringing so you can answer the call but you can't hear the phone because of all the smoke in the air or cloudiness whatever you want to call it so clearing all of that out allows you to hear the phone that's ringing so you can then answer the call so you can then basically be told or have it unfold as to where you're going in your next chapter the star yep have a good day